<laughs> Sorry, Harold. Clear my throat there. So, um, in the background here, I got playing um, Till the World's Awake by uh, Connie uh, Costins. So I'm going to talk about R, R, R. And this is a long three-hour film. Uh, it's 95% uh, fresh on Rotten Tomatoes from 100 uh, film critics. Consensus being, it is intoxicatingly over the top. RRR pulls out all the stops to make the app the most absolute of its 187 minute runtime, and 94% of audience members like it. I mean, on that itself, it's impressive that like a three hour plus movie <laughs> is, is very well received. Um, and the audience consensus is a uh, top notch singing and dancing combined with a terrific story to make RRR a three hour feast of entertainment. Yeah, I guess, yeah. So the premise is, um, yeah, it's a short, short one. Uh, it's the story of Freedom Fighters, uh, Komaram Beam and Aluri Sitarama Raju. Okay, I'm gonna be a little more descriptive than that. So, this film is about, um, two, uh, Indian men on kind of opposite ends of the, sort of, a uh, colonization of India from England, I think. Oh my goodness, I don't know my history. But uh, yeah, and then they kind of end up forming a friendship. And I'm not going to spoil the plot, but yeah, they um, kind of like join forces eventually to uh, save the day, or more specifically, <laughs> solve the conflict that's introduced in the film that I don't really want to get into. This film has a lot of masculine energy. Um, yeah, so the, the film stars on. Um, N.T. Rama, Rao Jr., Ram Charan, uh, Ajay Devgan, Aliyah Bhatt, uh, Shira Saran, uh, Samuthi Rakhani, Olivia Morris, Ray Stevenson, Allison Duty, S.S. Rajamuli is the director and the screenwriter. Um, and the film, the original language is uh, Telugu. So I assumed it was Indian, but I don't even know enough about India to know if Indian is actually like a national language, or even labeled as a language. But yeah, this film is in Telugu. So subtitles. Uh, but yeah, like I said, a lot of masculine energy. Um, <laughs> and really cool dance numbers. So it's definitely like got that Bollywood feel, if you're familiar with like Bollywood Indian movies. Um, I'm kind of curious to see how it was received, or when it came to like... Yeah, clothes and like awards. Um, let me. Sorry, hang on. Uh, yada 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 yada. Oh, the the song Naatu Naatu. Yeah. Oh, one best original song at the 95th Academy Awards. Yeah, definitely uh, a good song to dance to. I remember that making it the first song from an Indian film as well as the first from an Asian film to win in this category. Okay, cool, cool, did not know that. Um, yeah, I guess like when it comes to like cultural impact, I, I guess the theme song for this movie is what's gonna last, but the movie itself is pretty good too. Um, I mean, obviously, yeah. Interesting um, use of animals in this film, which, you know, of course, I assume none were harmed in the making. There are a lot of CGI effects. Most of them look fine. Some of them look kind of weird, but like, it's just the energy and like, kind of the positive like momentum that's going, <laughs> that flows through this film makes it sort of um, engaging to watch uh, until the end. Yeah. So definitely an action drama, a lot of action, um, and an epic. Yeah, I would call it an epic because, yeah, this film uh, like has a really big scope with a lot of characters. Uh, with the background being, yeah, the, the English like colonizing India and like Indians, you know, trying to like repel repel them or, or gain their their own freedom, uh, sense of autonomy. So it, it's 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 a really good. Uh, uh, hyperactive film, I'd say. That's RRR. Um, Alright. Well, until then, uh, take it easy. Peace.